Hi, this is Ron Nutter, the author of the Natural Disaster Survival Series, Are You Disaster Ready? And in this video playlist, we're going to be talking about emergency kits. Now, in another playlist, you've been seeing where we've been talking about first aid kits. First aid kits are just one component. There's all sorts of other things that, that you may want to think about having access to. Uh, parachute cord is something that I wouldn't have thought about, but there's all sorts of uses for that. Having different, uh, you know, portable can openers. So if you need to get to food and the power's out and you don't have other uh, can openers available, that's certainly an option. Or if you're in the middle of nowhere and don't have it, there are all sorts of uh, items that you might not think about. I have, for example, I have two portable carry kits that just look like items on a keychain. Unless you really start looking close, you don't realize that that's something that could get me through probably for several hours or longer. I've got a larger bag that has more items in it. I've got you know, a couple of small first aid kits. I've got different little gadgets and pieces and parts that by themselves may not be a big deal but when you look at having that kind of thing available it's like a certain credit card company's commercial in paraphrasing what they said it's priceless when you've got what you need and you this is not something you have to do day one and i talk about this in the other videos don't think you have to do everything day one this is a process now, it's not going to be a process that you're going to be a one-and-done situation. You'll be doing these over time as new technology, new items come about. Certainly, it's very prudent to, to look at those and seeing what is going to work best for you. And you may decide that something you have two years ago now is no longer a good fit because there's something that better suits your needs. What works for me may not work for you, but in going through... This book, you'll see the different options that I've come across, and I'm always looking. It's the responsible thing to do. And if you don't know about an area, you know you can learn. There, there's time to do that. But as long as you're doing a little bit, because if something happens, that's not the time to start your planning. You need to have things already in place. So you know it can be something on an emergency kit as simple as a supply of rechargeable batteries now you can certainly use the disposables but as we know once they're used up that's pretty much it what about if you have a prolonged situation and you need to recharge the batteries and power is still out i've got something that i can show you that was i found after i came out with this book but this book is is a living document it will get updated over time so there's all sorts of options so it's a little bit here a little bit there there will be links in in future videos to where you don't have to go hunt this down I will have done a lot of that footwork for you so one step at a time and if you have any questions please reach out to me because I want to be able to help you because if we all help each other then this world is a much better place thank you for your time and we'll see you in future videos